Hey guys, coming to you with another video from Big O's channel. Hope everybody had a good day. Hope everybody's doing good. If you're new to the channel, I'm gonna ask you to watch the entire video. If anything makes any sense, like, comment, subscribe, and share. And to my returning subscribers, respect. So like the title says, Hey Stranger Season. What is Hey Stranger Season? Hey, Stranger Season, let's get into it, is when you get a text, a phone call, a voicemail, an email, or even a DM of somebody who you have not talked into for days, weeks, months, even years, and this person, he or she, are trying to shoot their shot. Now, you might say, when does it occur? Oh, funny you should ask. Hey, stranger season really occurs at all times. It doesn't really matter. It can happen any given day, any given week, any given month. This happens all the time. But the peaks of hey, stranger season are November, December, January, February. Why? Thanksgiving, Christmas, the new year, Valentine's Day. The next peak season is May, June, July, August. Why? Spring, summer, everybody want to be out, everybody looking good, everybody supposed to be in the gym, everybody want to, you know, everybody want to wanna floss. Those are the peaks. So you might say, who does Hey Stranger season? Typically, it is somebody you had a situation ship with a relationship with an ex-boo, an ex-wife, an ex-husband, or somebody who's just trying to shoot their shot. You know, normally with the DMs too, they saw a picture posted on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter. You know, now you looking good, and this person said, you know what, let me just go for mine. That's what it is. Disclaimer. I have been guilty of being, of being a receiver and a giver of Hey Stranger Season. Guilty. Guilty as charged. I ain't even gonna say in front. You know, sometimes it worked, sometimes it didn't. As a matter of fact, I got a Hey Stranger. Today is January 14th, 2021. I got one on Tuesday. I take it a step further. In my cell phone right now, I have an album that says, Hey Stranger. And I screenshot when I get it. When I get somebody saying, Hey, how are you? Hey, Osagie. I was thinking about you. You were on my mind. And of course, Hey Stranger. Now you might say, but oh, he or she, they're being sincere. Maybe, maybe not. But I'm going to get into, from my experience, four reasons why you get a hey stranger. Number one, they horny. Self-explanatory, they horny. They trying to get some. Period. That's it. Self-explanatory. Number two, they lonely. They want somebody to talk to. Them. Want somebody to hear their problems. Okay. Reason number three, they hungry. They want some food. You, they want you to feed them. You would be surprised. I've gotten. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, um, you know you're such a good cook. Can I come over for dinner? No, you cannot. Reason number four, which is my personal, personal favorite. <laughs> they want some free attention and validation. They want somebody to tell them, you look good. You look all right. You doing good. They just want somebody to talk, speak good to them. I'm like, yeah, I'm good. I ain't doing all that. We if it ain't, we ain't, nah, I'm straight. Those are usually the four main reasons you get the hey stranger. 
It's so funny, my homegirl out in Chi-Town, true story, she has a Microsoft spreadsheet of numbers and phone numbers of dudes who hit her with the, hey, I was thinking about you. They hate strangers. So when she sees an unknown number or a number that she don't recognize, she has to go through the the, 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 the spreadsheet to match up on who, like, you know, you know that is deep. I mean, that's some next level stuff. I mean, I got the I got the album, but she got a spreadsheet. But it get like that sometimes. Hey, I, I, I respect it, you know? Now you might be saying, it ain't nothing wrong with hey, stranger. You, you know, what's wrong with it? Hey, to each his own. I'm just telling you from my experience, that's what it is. Recognize it. You know, this is this is just what I'm trying to tell you. Hey, stranger season. Now, I'm gonna share a few stories with you. Maybe you could relate. Story number one. Call my sister one day. I was coming home from work. I said, let me call my sister. The sis was good. What's going on? She said, you won't believe who called me today. I said, who? Her first love from high school going to college. Now, my sister is in her late 30s. I said, all right, how's so-and-so doing? She goes, oh, the dude was married. I said, so why is he hitting you up? She tells me he got divorced two weeks ago. Got divorced two weeks ago, and he hit her with the you know, so-and-so, I always loved you. You was always my first love. Blah, 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 blah. No, mofo, you are horny. That's it. And you thought about my sister. That's it. And my sister said, straight talk? If he would have just been honest, I would at least maybe listen. But you just got divorced. You talking about, I was thinking about you. Mofo, you horny. You ain't thinking about that. Story number two. I was talking with somebody a couple of years ago, maybe four years ago. We dated a couple of times off and on, you know. You know, it, it was it was cool, you know. I was going through my own personal stuff. So we kind of understood the situation shit, you know. We understood. We weren't going to be anything more than what it is. Cool. We under, we had that understanding. We just went, we just parted ways. I mean, one day I called. She never called me. She didn't call me back. I, just, I fell back left her alone. Whatever. This past October, true story, I'm in my bed laying down, tired, sleeping, had a long day at work, doing stuff. It's like 10, 30, 10, 45 at night. She calls me up. I didn't even recognize the phone number because I took a number out of my phone. I said, hello? She's like, hey, what's up? I said, who this? It's funny how people act like y'all friends when, you know, y'all not talking no more and y'all parted, parted ways. I said, who is this? She goes, oh, you don't remember me? I said, no, who is this? If you don't tell me who this is, I'm gonna hang up the phone. She finally told me who she was. I said, okay, what's good? Like, what's up? Uh, well, uh, I'm in Queens. I'm in a hotel. Won't you, won't you come over and hook a sister up? Absolutely not. I am not interested. No, thank you. You might say, but oh, it was, it was free. She, 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 she put it in. She put it in hand. No, I'm, I'm not interested. I was on my, I'm on my purpose. You should have had me when you had the chance. I'm good, sweetheart. No. I respect myself too much. That's a tip, you know? Don't cheapen yourself out. Don't cheapen your, or your, no. Don't cheapen it. Let people respect it. You respect it, they'll respect you more, even if they don't say it. Facts. Story number three. My homeboy, my homeboy Mark. We talk all the time. All the time, we talk maybe, maybe, maybe every other day. He has a young lady who calls him all the time. All the time. You know? They, oh, I was thinking about you. And he's like, yo, you're not trying to make moves. I'm seeing somebody. Why you keep calling me? You know why? She wants free. He tells me whenever she gets on the phone, and she always calls from a different number. So he doesn't even know half the time when she calls if it's her. He says, it starts off like this. Hey Mark, well yeah, you know, my my, I, I'm not, I don't have no money. I'm going through this. I'm going to ask always a uh, a uh, who done me wrong song. I'm like, damn, dude. Like, are you serious? He goes, yeah. All the time, I said, damn. Once again, free attention and validation. So, if you've experienced any of these, recognize it's just hey, stranger season. That's it.
If you're over 18, you're going to experience it or have. Trust me. Keep living. You know? So, <laughs> once again, hey, stranger season. You know, is we're we going into a new year. Get ready because it's coming. It, it, it's, it's inevitable. This is how it is, you know? So, if anything in this video made any sense, like, comment, share, subscribe. And with that being said, peace and love until the next video.